Creating realistic images has never been easier with 3ds Max and 3ds Max Design using iRay rendering technology from Mental Images. You will be able to generate physically accurate renderings without having to adjust and guess at any of the rendering settings. Let's use this condo space as an example. To help you understand the difference between iRay and other renderer, we will first render this scene in Mental Ray. Mental Ray, like most other rendering solutions, always requires a bit of guessing when it's time to fine-tune the rendering settings. The rendering window offers five different tabs and it can be a bit daunting to figure out all the settings if you are not an experienced user. For example, to achieve eye resolution for this interior space, I first need to go to the indirect illumination tab and increase the amount of final gather bounces. I will also refine the final gather precision. Then, under the Renderer tab, I will increase the Soft Shadow Precision Multiplier to 4, Glossy Reflection and Refraction Multiplier to 3, and increase the Sampling Quality to Minimum 1 and Maximum 16. This scene is quite heavy at 3 million polygons, which will definitely slow down my mental ray calculation. During the rendering process, the multiple mental ray passes allow me to guess what the rendering result will be, but I need to wait till the end of the rendering to save a usable image. Since this rendering is using high quality rendering settings, it took 2 hours, 40 minutes and 48 seconds to render. The result is very promising, but there is still some area of darkness where I expect to have light entering the condo, which will leave me guessing what setting I will need to refine in order to achieve better results. A technical expert will be able to quickly guess at the right settings for an optimal result, but many people do not have the desire or the time to learn the subtleties of the settings. Let's switch our rendering engine to iRay and compare the process. You will notice that the Rendering Setup window common tab stays the same and that only one additional tab is available for iRay rendering settings. Basically, the only setting you need to adjust to have a physically accurate, photorealistic rendering is the rendering time. You can either enter the time by hour, minute and second, number of passes, or let it render until you decide to stop it. So the rendering time is always predictable. Let's render this image for 2 hours, 40 minutes and 48 seconds, which is the same amount of time our mental ray rendering took. The minute iRay starts rendering, you can start seeing results. The image gets slowly refined as the number of passes increase. Plus, at any time you can pause and save the image of the rendering process. iRay progressively refines the image until the desired level of detail is achieved or that the limit you have entered is reached. You can now focus on applying physically accurate materials such as architecture and design material or Autodesk materials, photometric lights, and settings that truly resemble what you experience every day. iRay will give you a physical light calculation rendered, not an approximation of the results. You can see here the image at about 25% completion, and already I can predict the final quality of the image. I will stop that render and show you both images that have been rendered for the same amount of time side by side. You can clearly see that the iRay render bounced the light accurately in this space, giving me an exact real-life result. Notice the soft shadow precision, the quality of the reflection here on the wood floor and in the ceiling paint. Fine detail have been captured on object and the rendering results have photorealistic quality. Plus, the iRay rendering calculation is independent of the polygon count, so you can have a really heavy scene like this one without affecting your rendering time. With iRay, you will be able to understand how light enters your space, view soft reflection in your material, capture fine details on objects, and even view your self-illuminated object accurately. The effect of self-illuminated material is clearly shown here in this scene. The luminance amount is accurately calculated, giving me predictable results, something that was to this point impossible to render accurately. Depth of field, which increased the photorealistic look of your image, is also part of the rendering calculation and does not add any rendering time. iRay enables you to set up your scene, 
press render and get predictable photoreal results without worrying about rendering settings, just like a point and shoot camera. Iray progressively refines the image until the desired level of detail is achieved while letting you stay focused on your creative vision. Iray will work with standard multi-core CPUs. However, you can significantly accelerate the rendering process with minimal investments by purchasing NVIDIA CUDA-enabled GPU hardware.